A home with off-grid solar is energy self-sufficient. All power comes from on-site solar panels and battery storage. There are no connections to the electric grid. In this video, we'll explain how a large off-grid solar system powers a family home. Let's start with the morning. Although the sun isn't at full strength yet, the solar array should still generate enough power to meet the home's needs. This is possible in off-grid homes where residents are careful with their electricity usage and avoid installing appliances that use too much power or using too many at the same time. At midday, the sun is high in the sky. The solar panels hit their maximum output. This is also when energy needs are lowest, as most family members are out. Surplus energy is sent to charge the batteries. This is also a good time to operate energy-hungry appliances, such as an air conditioner or washing machine. In the afternoon, the sun moves lower in the sky, so solar panel output starts to fall. However, the solar panels will still produce more power than is needed. If the batteries aren't full yet, the extra power will be used to bring them up to 100%. On to the evening. With the setting of the sun, solar panel output falls to zero. This is also when power usage spikes, as family members return home and fire up electrical appliances. To meet this demand, lots of power will be drawn from the batteries. At night, the solar cycle is complete. No solar power will be generated until the following morning. Till then, all nighttime energy needs will be met by the batteries. This won't be a problem for a well-designed off-grid system. It should be able to store enough electricity to last two or three days without much sun. Of course, keeping ample backup power in reserve requires a lot of battery capacity, along with a higher number of solar panels to charge them. This makes off-grid systems expensive compared to simple grid-connect solar systems or even solar plus storage that can use the grid as a backup. This expense is the reason very few people install completely off-grid systems, unless they live in remote areas where there is no utility grid to connect. 